now I enjoyed with you yesterday's mind map. Did you complete mind map? Now understood about the mind map. Why we have to learn in the method of mind map? Did you get the idea? Did you uh, show the creativity in your mind map, children? Yes, yes, you are very good children. So today I am going to start uh, next lesson of the social studies. So as per the present scenario, we are all are in lockdown. So we have to complete our portion. According to the instructions, we have deleted few lessons. Those are lesson 3 and lesson 4. So now I am continuing with the lesson 5. What is lesson 5 children? Do you know? Yes, lesson 5 is the early man. Do you know who is early man? He was the ancient man. You know ancient man? He was an animal. We are all are animal. Do you know which animal? Yes, from the caves. They are from the caves. Apes means nothing. It is the category of monkey, mongoose and gorilla. Did you see gorilla? Where did you see? Yes, in the zoo. Yes. So, now coming to the early man. He was the apes. Like this, and he made the tools. To 
holes means he made the with the, another stone he made the sharp toes like this. These are the first tool of the Hello children. Today we are going to learn about the early humans. One day, while reading about old civilization, Tom fell asleep. He dreamt that he and his sister have gone back in time to a place where everything was very different and civilization was just starting. I wonder where we are. Looks like someone's coming. Quick, hide. Look at that man. What a thick and long beard he has. Uh oh. It looks like you've come a really long way back in time. We are in the stone age. That man is an early human. What does early human mean? Early humans are people who lived a long time ago. Let's follow and see where he goes. What is he wearing? Early humans did not wear clothes like ours. They covered their bodies with tree leaves and animal skins. Look, there are more people ahead. Let's see what they are doing. What is that? That's an animal that they've hunted. How did they kill that animal? Early humans killed wild animals with the help of sharp stones. Listen. They are talking. 
but I cannot understand what they are saying. Early man could not talk like we do, so they made sounds or used their hands to point to things while talking to one another. Look, they are taking the animal and going somewhere. Let's follow them. Look, they are going into that cave. Yes, that is where they lived. Early humans did not live in houses like ours. They lived in caves and on trees found in the forests. Why did they live on trees or in caves? Wild animals like tigers, lions and elephants also lived in the forest. So they lived in places where they would be safe from wild animals. The cave had to be big enough for people to live here. They would eat, sit and sleep here. They would also store their food here. What food did they eat? Their food was meat, wild fruits and roots. They would go from one place to another to search for food. And do you know, they ate raw meat because they did not know how to cook it on a fire. Later, they learned to make fire by rubbing two stones together. And then they would cook their food before eating it. Did you know that early humans liked to draw? They decorated the walls of their caves with drawings of animals and scenes showing how they lived. Oh boy, what a crazy dream. All right, children. We have now reached the end of this chapter. Let's recap what we just learned about the early humans. Early man lived very long ago. He did not look like us. Early man did not wear clothes like ours. He wore leaves and animal skins. Since they did not know how to make houses, early humans lived in caves or trees. Early man would hunt animals and search for wild fruit and berries to eat as food. 